Good morning, morning Richland, Richland High School. School. Thank, Thank you, you for viewing Ram TV. TV. Today is Tuesday, October 7th. Tomorrow is Green Day. Here's what's happening at Richland High School. Student dismissal times for Tuesday, October 7th. Varsity Tennis, 2.30. Today's 7th grade line soccer game will be between Team 3 and Team 4. There will be a French club meeting on Thursday, October 9th. The meeting will begin at 7.05 a.m. in room C105. All members should attend this meeting. Attention theater musical tech students. If you did not attend the theater certification class last week, there will be another class offered Thursday, October 16th from 7 to 8 in the theater. Adjust your schedule now to be able to attend. It is mandatory that all students participating in the theater activities will be certified. Attention all members of the Senior High Forensics team. Practices will be held after school in the library every Tuesday and Thursday until 4 p.m. Come when you can. A representative from the Army will be in the cafeteria during period 5 lunch today for interested students. RHS SAD is promoting the Creating Real Impact Contest, which is offered by Impact Teen Drivers Fund to promote our ongoing commitment to providing awareness and education regarding the dangers of distracted driving and poor decision making. The contest process runs until Friday, October 10, 2014, so you will need to start now. Go to Create a creator creator create real create real impact dot <laughs> command submit your video and music submit. creative writing or artwork then go to the RHS sad Facebook and let us know of your entry <laughs> the girls varsity soccer team lost last night two nothing to Bedford the girls record is now seven wins six losses and two ties the next game is senior night on Wednesday versus Johnstown. Kickoff is at 7. The girls junior varsity soccer team tied Bedford last night. The girls were up 2-0, but the Bedford team battled back to score two late goals for the tie. Mara Trebold had both Richmond goals. The girls' JV record is now six wins, one loss, and two ties. Congratulations to the JV football team with their 32-12 win over Greater Johnstown last night. Ethan Dabbs scored four rushing touchdowns, Logan Bowser scored one touchdown, and Keegan Smith had two, had one two-point conversion. Brady Thomas, Ben Saloga, and Kobe Pascarella, and Tim Ribble each had one interception. <clears throat> Attention boys tennis players. Anyone who is interested in joining the boys tennis team this year should stop by Mr. Johnson's room, B115, this week. This is necessary in order to get names and information to make a winter schedule and allow players off-season access to North Fork Tennis Center. Hashtag winning. The junior high boys soccer <coughs> team lost 5-0 to to a strong Westmont team yesterday. They hope to bounce back tomorrow against Cambria Heights. The following colleges will be visiting Richland in October. Mount Aloysius, Clarion, St. Francis, Washington, and Jefferson, Seton, Hill, and Lock Haven. Interested students can sign up in the guidance office. And now for the weather. I'm here with your weather for today. It's currently 50 degrees and the high is 70. Oh my god! I'm here with your weather for today. The high is 70 and the low is 48. It's currently 50 degrees out. I'm here with your weather for today. The high is 70 degrees and the low is 48. It's currently weather for today. The high is 70 and the low is 48. And it's currently. Oh, can I redo? I'm here with your weather for today. The high is 70 degrees. Hi, I'm Austin here with your weather for today. The current temperature is 50 degrees. The high for today is 70. The low for today is 48. Might be a little chilly at the boys soccer game, so bring your jackets at 7 o'clock. Go Rams. Why did the fish get a bad report card? Because all of his grades were under C. But on not Hi, I'm here with your current events for Tuesday, October 7th. Currently, the first American Ebola patient is being treated with experimental medicine in Texas. Across the ocean, Spain has quarantined three individuals after a nurse was diagnosed with Ebola. Federal police in Mexico launched a unit to take charge of a southern city. The city has been the site of extreme gang violence and activity, including the disappearance of many students. 
but the officials plan to clean the local forces of corruption and put an end to the gang presence. A man proposed to his girlfriend in a hot air balloon in California. Unfortunately, the air balloon fell into the water and the couple had to be saved by local servers. The newly engaged man promises to avoid repeating that in the future. That's it for your world news. See you tomorrow. Death by roadkill. As we just witnessed here today, a bird was flying away to his happy place when a car came speeding down this road and hit the bird dead on. We have now known the bird. Now know the bird's name. It was Joe. We now have information about the car. It was a white suburban. We did not get the plates, but we do know it was hit by a car. Actually, that's the car right there. Right there. Okay, we're going in. Going to investigate now. Hi, I'm Russell White. Russell, can you tell us a little bit about your upcoming tournament? Well, our tournament this weekend at Planet Ice. We play at 849 and 520 and 620. So we play three games. Alright, that's all for Russell White. Have, Have a, a great, great day. day.